this is the first, uh, the first, uh, my first uh, Yamaha. And um, so when I come the first time, uh, at the beginning we, we try uh, to make this bike more uh, beautiful. <laughs> so also about color, <laughs> because before was not very, <laughs> was a little bit ugly. <laughs> so we, we make a good design uh, and we put uh, some of, of my yellow on the, on the, blue, on the blue design. And uh, I think at the end of the bike was, uh, was beautiful. And uh, we work uh, very much on the engine at the beginning. And uh, Mr. Furuzawa prepared to me three different engines for uh, the side for 2004 season. And uh, we decided for, uh, for this one that have uh, a little bit less, uh, less power than the previous but uh, a lot uh, more uh, uh, soft uh, feeling, uh, smooth uh, uh, and easy to, to ride. So the, the engine delivery uh, was uh, a lot more sweet compared to, to the pre previous engine. And uh, step by step Yamaha tried to improve the power. That uh, was the main, the main issue. Um, in all uh, his history, usually Yamaha was very, is very good to, to make uh, chassis. So the bike uh, have a, a, a good agility, good uh, turning. But uh, we, we have to, to work a little bit on, on the stability, the stability in braking. Uh, and uh, we try to improve the, the rear grip uh, of the bike. Uh, and uh, with, the, with the some uh, small modify, uh, the bike was, uh, was ready for, uh, for the first race. But also during all the season, we continue to work, uh, try to improve the power, and uh, at the end, we, we were able to, to win the first, uh, the first championship. This is uh, the, the second, uh, the second uh, M1, the 2005 uh, version. And uh, this bike maybe is, uh, is the best uh, M1 uh, of our uh, history together, the most competitive because uh, uh, remain the good, uh, the good turning and the good agility of the year before, but the bike improve a lot, uh, the engine improve a lot. Uh, uh, Yamaha work, uh, work a lot of, on the engine and uh, remain with the same uh, smooth uh, power, uh, uh, sorry, delivery, but with a lot more power. And this bike was also very fast uh, on the straight. So we make a, make a big step. Uh, if you look at this bike uh, uh, close to the 2004 version, have a lot, a lot of uh, difference. And uh, this is like the the the, the, f the grandfather of of the last uh, of the last version. Uh, the details uh, are uh, all uh, at 100 uh, percent. The bike uh, was uh, very precise in all the parts. Change uh, a lot also the, the carling uh, for uh, the aerodynamic uh, side. And uh, the bike was uh, uh, not just uh, the faster, but maybe one of the most uh, beautiful bike uh, of, uh, of Yama during this, uh, this season. Remain 990s, uh, uh, but uh, in, uh, in this version, uh, the, the power improved a lot compared to the 2004 that was uh, um, a bike uh, between 2003 and 2005. This is uh, the, like the last version. And it um, was very good to ride. Uh, we work very much also on the electronic uh, side. We start uh, with, uh, with all the system for uh, help uh, the slide uh, with some traction control, but also help the wheelie. So I think the secret of that, that bike was, uh, was the balance because the bike was uh, very fast on the straight, but at the same time uh, remain uh, easy to, to use, easy to ride, uh, and uh, easy to, to make a, a good setting. Uh, so uh, with this bike, we were able to win the championship and 11 races. Uh, so it was uh, maybe the best, the best M1. The 2006 bikes, uh, bike was uh, more similar to, to 2005, 
but uh, we we try we try to improve the bike but unfortunately we create uh, a big problem because uh, this bike was different uh, in this area for uh, for improve the the agility for improve the turning but unfortunately we cause uh, a, a big big problem called uh, chattering uh, after some races we understand uh, that uh, in this area the bike was not strong enough and uh, in the in the hard uh, braking in the hard corner uh, the, the front bike uh, the front part of the bike will make a hard vibration and become very difficult to ride quite impossible because if you push more you have this uh, hard vibration with a high high frequency and uh, always you lose the front so unfortunately it was uh, was a big problem that uh, make uh, us to lost the first part of the season. I say unfortunately because also this bike have uh, a good potential, was very fast, the engine uh, was fast in the straight, and, but we lose the first four or five races for, uh, for this problem. When, uh, when we understand, uh, we make some modify, we fix the chattering problem, but at that moment we had already a big disadvantage in the championship. But with uh, some uh, good races, uh, some victories, we come, uh, we come back for, uh, for the, for the um, challenge, for the battle. Uh, but in the second part of the season, we have also to manage the, the tire problem. Because in that, in that season, uh, uh, we started to, to have some problem with the Michelin tires. So we make some good result, but also some, uh, some zero, some retirement. Uh, we had, uh, we had some, uh, some big unlucky, unfortunately, and we cannot use the, the maximum potential of this bike. And uh, at the end, uh, I lose the championship in the last race in Valencia because I crashed. But, uh, yeah, some good memories because of some great victories, like uh, Saxaring uh, starting from 11 places, uh, 11 places and uh, arrived first. Uh, and, uh, and some, unfortunately, some bad memories, and uh, we cannot... Uh, uh, use the potential of the of the 2006 version. Unfortunately, in 2007, uh, the rules change, and uh, from uh, the 1000 bike, we have to switch to the 800. Uh, we cannot understand why. <laughs> A lot of people don't understand why, and. Uh, Yes, I, I think it's not the right decision because uh, the, the 1000 bike was uh, more exciting and uh, uh, better to, to drive and better to, to race with each other. But anyway, all the people have, have to, to change uh, radically the bike. The bike become smaller, a little bit lighter uh, with a smaller engine. And uh, this is the first, uh, the first version in 2007. And it uh, was, was a very difficult season because uh, all the, the Japanese uh, manufacturers uh, um, work uh, in, in one way for, uh, for the engine and also the rules change because they have less uh, liter in the, in the tank. So the bike become also um, less power for sure but also more difficult uh, to ride and, uh, and we, had, uh, we had a lot of problems. But especially we have to um, fight uh, with the, 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 the Ducati that make uh, a very fast uh, bike in that season. At the same time, uh, we had uh, the problem of, uh, of the tires because in 2007, uh, Bridgestone became uh, clearly better than, uh, than Michelin after a lot of, uh, of uh, season. So we have to manage these, these two types of, uh, of problems. And um, we try to don't, uh, to don't give up, try to uh, keep open the championship, especially against uh, Stoner, that was very fast. We make some, uh, some victories, but uh, at the end, uh, we, had some, uh, some, we had too much uh, problem for try to, to win. And uh, the, the big problem was uh, the, the lack of power uh, in, in the straight. But at the same time, uh, Ducati worked very well uh, on the electronic system for, for uh, help uh, the riding of the bike. So 
at the end of that of 2007 season, um, I speak a lot with uh, with Mr. Furuzawa for uh, for try to improve uh, the bike under this uh, this point of view. So with this bike, uh, have uh, mainly bad memories, but uh, also some some good victory like Mugello, but especially Assen, starting from from 11th place and, and won the race, but. Uh, was the first uh, 800 version, and there was the, the, the father of, of the next uh, the M1 that uh, bring us uh, a lot of uh, victories.